Hello graphic friends, Razvan is my name. Welcome back to the world's Let's Play of the World, Copic Tool Ever Edition Hardcore. We have just met Diego. He told us about his situation with the scrappers. He wants to go out of the valley, we can take him with us. But in order to do that, we have another NPC we can take out, also Bilgat. So we can hit uh, one bird with two birds with one stone, I believe it is a saying, right? In order to achieve that, we have to go and rescue the other guy. Because otherwise we would have to take two spot, uh, two trips. Oh. Hitting the Nirvana. Yeah, a little bit of lag somehow. <clears throat> So we have also another quest for another NPC, it's the Lutero in Corinus. He wants to get a special claw from a special... Oh, that's like from a special uh, sniper. We'll have to check what's at that tower anyway. So here used to be the old town. I believe there are some things here. Yeah, potion. And on the other side is something also. Yeah, I wish they would. Oh no, actually they cannot. It doesn't make sense that they would restore the Orc city because... Really, there is nothing? Ah, there it is. Ocean and the gold candlestick. I believe that's it. It makes no sense that they would restore the city because it got collapsed due to the sleepers' defeat. We have to remember that we have to keep ourselves quiet. Full health. Oh, this is a not good. Okay. The arrow doesn't want to. Yeah, it's a bit buggy. I have to admit it. It's a bit buggy. We didn't get anything important. We did level up. We have to learn the next bow, but we still have time for that. All right. Before we do that, let's talk to the guy, to Bilgat. He's going to give us the quest. I believe if we kill them before he is not going to give us the quest. So Where do you come from? I'm here on behalf of Garand. Very good. I can certainly use new men. I am not here to assist you. No? Then why did you come? My mission is to find out how much ore you have mined so far. Listen. I don't know why Garand sent me a mercenary. But he must have a reason. But before I send you back, you will carry out a mission for me. Everything has its yeah, price. we are mercenary. Amy, I might consider it. I am not accustomed to doing business with mercenaries. Time to learn it. Haggling for a better price, but as a token of my goodwill, I'll pay you 100 gold pieces if you work for me. Do we have an agreement? That's so cheap. What can I do for you? For days, a horde of snappers has been roaming around our camp. Looks like they're just waiting for a good opportunity to attack. I don't know what they're waiting for. But as long as they're here, there's no peace to be had in the camp. That Fed, above all the rest, is scared out of his mind. And driving the other convicts crazy. No, tell me so about who it. should I send? Bill Gott? Ha. Huh. He's a wreck too. And Tengron? Sure, he can fight. But he lacks the necessary guile. The only one who can do it is you. I want you to hunt down those damn beasts and kill them. Okay. Thanks for donation. What about that guy? Jurgen, he is a hunter. Uh, yeah, we have to talk with Bilgat and then hey, kill the other monsters around. He just come from the castle. Yes, I come from the castle. Why? What's the situation there? No better than here. 
The orcs are still there, if that's what you mean. Getting yeah, dark time. Safe anywhere. I'll tell you something. If I weren't scared shitless, I just beat it out of here. What do you know about the snappers? Why do you want to know that? And don't tell me you're just curious. I'm going Not to hunt those snappers. That's crazy. I've watched them. Those are bloodthirsty beasts. Then tell me what you know about them. Hmm. Yeah, I can help you, but only under one condition. What do you want? If you manage to kill the snappers, then you have to get me out of here. I can't take it here much longer. Have you talked to Fed? The guy is wrecked, and I don't want to end up like him. Tell me what you know, then I'll get you this out of here. This the special I snapper. I could count on you, so pay attention. I've watched the snappers for quite a while. They're very cunning, and they have a kind of communication. But they never go alone and attack only in a pack. But there's something else. There's a lizard among them that's different. It rarely shows up, but I've seen it. The other beasts bow when they go past it. But they always keep it in sight as they do so. As long as that one doesn't move, no lizard in its vicinity will. Where can I find that bloody beast? I saw it by the steps of the old watchtower. Fine. I think I understand. Thank you. Remember, you gave me your word. What are you doing here anyway? I'm the general dog's body here. Schlep stuff around, keep an eye on the snappers. Bill got here, Bill got there. Yeah, I should have just stayed home with my old lady. It wasn't any different there, but at least there was something decent to eat. And now I'm all that remains of the men-at-arms that were assigned to Fajith. How was I to know that this expedition wasn't gonna make it back? My pal Olaf made himself scarce. Maybe he pulled it off. Yeah, there are some people that we have to search for. So that spawned us the sniper. It is up there. But in order, I want to kill those one before they go too close to the camp. Oh, we almost one shot them. That's quite good. Too bad we don't actually one shot them. Then we, we would have an easy life. Yeah. One shotting would have been perfect. Those guys can get quite annoying. And very close to the camp. Okay, we will we will deal with this side of the mountain later on when we are stronger. We will have to come here anyway. To kill the dragons, then we have to do some some sort of clearing. So here we have another pack of snappers. It's quite annoying. Yeah, we, we have good arrows, good amount of arrows, yeah, for the aim. From here there should be 100% hit chance, like for real, when they are up close in your face. Maybe you reduce damage, okay, agree with that. Are there any goodies, but at least 100 hit percent. I don't know, probably there are some things in, on those rocks. Uh, we are far away from the next level. But after we are done with the Valley of Mines, we will go to Yarkandar because in Corinis is going to be crazy. That's just perfect. Normally I don't do this way. I go to Yarkandar first. There it is, right? Yeah, pack leader. He's even weaker than the rest. And this guy has the snapper claws, no matter what, if you have the heal or not, you will get it. Ooh, there is lizards. Where is the guy? Coming. Really? Is he coming here? 
or did we lose him to Nirvana? Ah, there it is. Perfect. We are a good hand hunter this time. Potion vine. Oh, some gold. Okay, when he stops five arrows, we are going to. Oh, okay. Now he's going to aggro us. But experience is experience. So now we can get builded with us. The guy should be safe for the time being. So, Fayette, where is our 100 hey. gold that we wasted on arrows anyway? I killed the leader of the pack. Good. Without a leader, they're only half as dangerous. I don't think they'll attack us anymore. Here is your gold, as agreed. Ah, oh, damn it. How much ore you've mined we so killed far. the snappers the also. Garand, that so far we've only been able to mine two chests of ore. I've already taken too many losses thanks to the constant attacks. If Garand can send me more men, then we can mine more ore. I see. I'll let him know. Good. Then the rest is up to you. We'll hold the position here for as long as we can. Okay, only two. The other guy's four and four. It's time, Bilgut. Pack your things. We're off. I'm ready. So the Bilgut can go wherever we go. So yeah, gun. You killed the leader of the pack. And did you get the claws off that beast? Yes. They're certainly worth a lot. There are some fellows who collect this stuff. If you find the right buyer, you'll get a heap of gold for that. What are you doing here? I'm a scout. I roam the country. But all those snappers haven't made it easy for me. It's a good time to land a few trophies, provided you know what you're doing. What can you teach us? You teach me how to do that? Remove the horn place from the... the claws off those things once no. they're dead. Damn it. What do I need to know about this area? The green hides have laid siege to the castle for weeks the oh. entire... That's the things we know. So, ten grom. Can be with you. Do you bring news from the castle? Are reinforcements coming soon? No. Nope. I come to bring news, but to get news. Then speak to Thajeth. He's in command here. But if you have news from the castle, then let me know. More money for us? About the news. Yeah. What's the situation in the castle? It's still besieged by the orcs, and also still open to the dragon's attacks. Oh, damn. I hope the boys will hold out. Listen, a friend of mine is in the castle. His name is Udar, and we've known each other a the long arrogant time. Arrogant crossbow. A lot of battles side by side. I want you to take him this ring. He's to keep it safe for me. Tell him I'll get it when I come back. No problem. When I get to the castle, I will give the ring to Udar. Good. The magic of the ring will give Udar new strength. Hey, and tell him that I'll get it back from him. Okay, we'll do so. What kind of ring is that? Twenty. Out. That's bad. Oh, we had this ring. Not that the three extra strength really matter. Yeah, sadly there are no teleports, or at least I didn't find the teleports anymore. Ed, hey. are you still crazy? Are you all right? The snappers seem to have pulled back, but that doesn't mean anything. They'll come back, or the wolves, or the lizards, or the orcs. And Nobody. Or later, they'll get us and feed on our dead bodies. Yeah, we could beat one of those convicts and get their pickaxe. Because we sold out ours, or we lost it. So here is a chest, do they mine? Okay, they don't mind. Ooh, that's good. Quite good. We got more rewards from this chest than the... Tengrath's Fayette's quest. So, Bill got, let's go. 
we go get Diego and then we have to see which route he is going to accept. Luckily they can sprint, yeah. We have to remember that Pilgut is quite weak. How much health does he have? Oh, 1400, okay. I take it back, he has increased health like crazy. But still we are not going to clear anything with them, just want to get them out of the way. Only with Diego we have to do some things. Something special. Let's go together. To the pass? Why not? You go first. You've only just come from there. But don't even think about going too close to the castle or to the orc wall. Also, we need to avoid all fortified camps of the paladins. I have just escaped from one, and I don't intend to go back toiling in one of the mines. And it goes without saying that we're not going near any dragons. Let me know when you're ready. Uh, yep. Come with me. All right. So he has less health than Pilgot. And Diego is not immortal. Oh, please don't tell me we crash. So we are back. Sadly, uh, luckily we didn't have to accept too long. For some reason the game was just moving, barely moving, but didn't want to crash. So I decided to force stop it and just redo it. So Diego doesn't want to go near any dragons, near any camps with the paladins, with orc wall, with the orcs and or anything. He only wants to get out of the mining colony, the old penal colony, as they used to call it. I forgot around the castle which route he wants to take, if it's the forest or something like that. There is a dragon snapper that we are going to have to kill without taking its horns. The horns are worth quite a lot. And there are a lot of dragon snappers later on, that's why we need an income of cash because the armors that we have to make are quite expensive, so they don't mind. Yeah, this is the good route. I should have checked the map, what route they usually want to take. Well, Bilgot goes any anywhere. Some ice walls that we don't want to deal with. The sound is so nice of the footsteps. I know that they want to go here because on the left side there is the other paladin camp and the Diego doesn't want to go any near any paladins. Luckily we cleared most of the route. The only problem is going to be near the castle. I have no clue what are they going to do there. Did we lose Bilgot? Damn it. We lost Bilgot. What if we sleep? Is he going to come back? Oh right, I believe if we sleep they they simply go to the next waypoint, right? Going to check, if not I'll have to backtrack back and record back again when we are here. But I believe that's what they do. So there we will have to sneak by the orc with the arrows. There it is. Oh, damn it. Oh, he does a lot of damage. I think that's a bad idea what we did.
Okay. Oh well, we died, but that's a good thing that we died. At least we have them back again. And we don't sleep. I forgot about that. So, they are still following us. It's a bit hard, as you guys can see, if you want to take them out of the colony without teleports. Normally, you could just use the teleport to the... to the pass. Okay, we have them both. They would be perfect now. I believe here are the problems. Yep. We go this way. And then this way, right? Yes. So that orc is a big problem. The scouts are quite a big problem for us because from a range they hit like a truck and from up close we are quite weak. Ah, that's where we lost him last time, right? Because Diego is now here stuck. Diego? Yeah, that's where we lost Bilgot. There are some orcs in this forest if we want to go there. Okay, the next hard stuff is going to be here with the scout. Because I'm sure that Diego doesn't want to get any closer to the bridge. And if we have to swim, we might end up in trouble. But let's check it. Do they swim? Oh, actually they do. So, another save and up. From here on... Oh, damn it. Wait! Doesn't want to go any closer, right? Bilgot, please come back. Snapper, okay. Snapper. We lose Bilgot, right? Can we talk to him? Or we have to kill that orc? Bilgot, my friend. Hey. Um. So here is a dragon snapper that I know of. I want to avoid it. Okay. We are stuck in something. Here you go. Diego doesn't come, right? I think he Diego might not come. Diego came. There it is, and we aggro it. Let's hope we can outrun it. I wanted to save it, but whatever. 
Whatever, we lost one. There's Not a big scummy one less monster around. So let's go guys. Looks like we manage it only with one. The other guy. The Diego getting him out of the valley is a bit tricky because we have to do something more special with him. We have to bring him to the spot where we got toast into the valley of mines the first time in the graphic. If we go there, we got the nostalgic bonus, that's 500 experience, and we can kill Diego for a fun uh, chat into the next chapter once we go to Karina. So, Bilgut, you should be gone. There we are. Now hit the road. This area is hot. Thank you. Don't get yourself eaten. That'd be a pity. Farewell. Bilgut doesn't go anywhere from here. Diego, my friend, we have to lure some orcs and let them hit you. This is very risky, what we try to do, but we have to. Hit Diego a couple times, please. Okay. One less monster. Nothing to be had there. So for some reason he is immortal here. Only for the special dialogue if you kill him. We only do it for the sake of the playthrough. Normally are more monsters, right? More orcs. Let's lure them. Okay, that's not what I wanted. <coughs> we have to kill him. For the experience. One more, and then we have to let the, the orcs deal with him a bit. We did it. We did work bad. We have to have him alive, sorry. <coughs> One less monster around. Okay. One less monster around. As I said, we have to have him weaker. We didn't get him any weaker, sadly. So very important. Here. Remember back then, one thousand when we met here for the first time? It's been ages. There was something else in this place. That's also a hint for his money that he's missing. Damn, I just can't remember. Whatever. I shall go the rest of the way by myself. I have a few things to take care of before I can return to Corinus. Thank you, my friend. I'll see you in town. So, now we can kill him for the fun Just of the... You wait, you son of a bitch. We didn't kill him for good. It's just a fun thing. I never really do it, but because of the gameplay. And this is very important to remember. That's why he said he remembers something. Here is his stash of gold. That he sends you once you go to Corinis to him and he sends you back here. Just ignore that we kill him, please. It's 
heartbreaking to kill our good old friend. But it is what it is. And now we can get out of the Valley of Mines. Sadly, it takes a long while because there is no teleporter. We got 1,500 experience from Diego doing this trick and some money. Not a proud thing to do, as I said. We heard some wolves dying. We burned this guy, didn't we? Nothing there. Why are they still here? The wolves. Weird. There are the orcs, okay. We have to take it this route anyway. Nothing rot rotting corpse. So this is for Diego. That was his weapon and his bow. That's with strength, we don't need such. Oh we can get a better shield, is it better? Fifteen hit points. And if I know this is better, so we have to sell this piece of junk. Well, we are out of the Valley of Mines, but we are stupid. We are out of the Valley of Mines for no reason. Yeah, too early. Too soon. Too soon. We forgot to give the, the report to Garand and to rescue Gorn. Luckily and sadly, we are not done yet. We would have to go here anyway to bring back the Diego and so on and the bill got so we will go back to the castle and then we will talk with the people inside the castle to rescue Gordon and so on because there is no more teleporter to the castle to the valley of mine to the pass either they remove them or they set them somewhere else so i guess um yeah let's go to the castle and then we'll make a cut should be quite fast And I have questions for you guys. Do you actually play as a crossbow, as a bow character, dexterity character, or what's your favorite gameplay? I enjoy the most as a one-handed paladin with some magic. We get dexterity in the normal game passively to pick lock, uh, to pickpocket everyone. I, I always love to pickpocket the NPCs because that's a lot of experience, a lot of goodies. So that's why I prefer to have always Dex. The, the mage character is okay, but I don't really find it nice because you have a long while to go before you can actually use good magic. It's a fun gameplay too. But usually I like to play either as one-handed or with dexterity. I, I do like the assassin types, like in Skyrim, where you can uh, backstab everyone. That's a fun gameplay for me. That was bad. That was very bad. Luckily, we can run like crazy. Fast. This is bad, because there is a bow. Orc. Oh, ten. Did he go back? Yeah, we can't. Oh, he's still shooting. Can I do it? Please tell me you went back. Yeah, for some reason, this is a safe area. Marked as a safe area. Nice. We made it back to the castle in one piece. 
have to admit, yeah, it's thanks to the sprinting mod, but without it is quite annoying. So we have some quests here to take care of, uh, sell some stuff, earn some money, because hmm, we are good on money, but still. We have to sell a lot of stuff that we don't need here. Cavalon's leather bag, that's also good. We have a quest with him, yeah. I guess we are going to make a cut here. I'll thank you guys very much for joining me. I'll see you in the next episode. Be cool and bye bye.